Okay, we've got the blue base on. Now we're going to do the stitches. First thing I do is get your darker shade of blue. I'm going to use a metallic here. You don't have to get that close, Chris. Pull out a little bit. Okay, that's good. And I make the line with the metallic blue. And you can take a brush. I just like to use my finger. Smear it. And smear it in the same direction. I'm going down with this for the down shadow. And we're going to use some white for the highlight on top. And you guessed it, we're going to just smear, push up a little bit and smear upward. And then with a, I'm going to use a number six brush with a black. I'm going to make a little dot and kind of pull halfway down, dot halfway up. Dot halfway down, dot halfway up. Not really doing a complete line because we're going to put white in the middle there. And then using same number six brush, I'm going to load it with the white. Not really that wet. I'm going to kind of dry it there so it's like a dry brush almost. But Put our stitches on there. Then I'm going to get the smallest brush I have. This is probably a one. And I'm going to load that with the dark blue again. Not too wet. And that is just going to be the fine shadow on the right side of my stitches. And, you know, if you want it a little bit deeper, you can come in here with your dark blue again. You just kind of darken it up a little bit. You can, leave a, you can go in there with some black if you want it to look like a deep cut. Usually with Sally, I just go for the thin cut since she's a doll. But you can bring some black in there and kind of deepen it too. And there you have stitches. Here, let me hold the phone now. Make sure we get a good angle there. Oh, really close. Boop. Stitches.